I was just thinking, uh, uh, the, anyway, I started off without you. And I sold a lot of state secrets and a lot of very important things that we shared. Now, all kidding aside, look, we're teaming up to design and develop uh, new technology that are going to transform the lives of our people around the world. And together, we're lifting the private and public uh, partners to make this possible, including launching a new program between Indian and America, American astronauts, Indian astronauts, and entrepreneurs, scientists, students. Simply put, our countries are take, taking innovation and cooperation to a new level in our relationship. And, uh, and thanks in large part to the folks around this table. So my message today is really simple. We've got to keep it up, and we have to uh, make sure we aim even higher. We're, uh, we're going to see more technolo technological change. You've heard me say this a number of times in the next 10 years than we saw in the last 50 years, and maybe in the next few years, in the last 50 years. <clears throat> and uh, we need your help. And I'm talking to the CEOs around this table, Indian and American. We need your help to seize the moment, to help manage the risk to our societies, our economies, and to our nation's national security. We need your help to build guardrails around emerging technologies so that they're trustworthy, they're secure, and uphold our shared value and human rights. We need you to help us expand our partnership in the new fields of biotechnology as well as quantum. You know, as you all know well, innovation and collaboration are rarely without obstacles. And uh, so you raise our ambitions, and I want you to let us know what stands in the way of our ambitions as well. Be straight with us. The uh, speed bumps are, are uh, in, in, in PPD technological partnership, what they are, when they occur, so the Prime Minister and I can commit to building around them, over them, and through them. Because it matters, our cooperation matters, not just to our own people, but I quite frankly think to the whole world, because our partnership is about more than the next breakthrough or the next deal, and uh, as big as they may be. It's about taking climate change. It's about tackling it. It's about exploring the universe. It's about uh, lifting people out of poverty, curing cancer and other serious diseases, preventing pandemics, and giving our citizens, all our citizens, real opportunity. And about, it's about forging a more free, secure, and more prosperous future for our children, supporting the dynamism and diversity of our democracies and democracies everywhere. We're sticking up for our values and the vision of our the vision of the world. And so our partnership between India and the United States will go a long way, in my view, to define what the 21st century looks like. And our technology, technological cooperation, will be a big part of defining our partnership, our partnership. So we look forward to continuing working with all of you and on our voyage of discovery, as was referenced, and uh, to building a better future. And I want to thank all the CEOs again for being here. And uh, with that, I'm going to turn it over to the Prime Minister to say nice things about me. President Biden and uh, all friends here, in a way, uh, saying sometimes it's a little difficult to say too much in front of all the press uh, present here. But first of all, I would like to thank uh, President Biden for participating in this event. And uh, you have seen that from agriculture to space, uh, there are all the sectors represented here that touch our lives in every way. And uh, technology uh, is uh, something that touches our lives. And all technology sectors are represented here. And uh, there are well-established firms here and startups here as well. And both of them uh, can uh, work to, are working together to create a new world. And I'm very pleased that under the leadership of President Biden, technology, uh, understanding the importance of uh, technology, the progress that America has made in the area of technology, 
and uh, the youth in India, thanks to its talent, has created an identity for itself in the world. So this uh, coming together of uh, talent and technology, I believe this uh, is definitely a guarantee for a bright future. This morning, the discussion we've had with just a few friends, but uh, this morning is uh, with us, giving us a guarantee for a bright future. And this is a very uh, small group of people, but this is a very promising group, a wonderful group, and uh, one which is going to give a direction to the world, which is going to uh, build uh, the future of the world. And uh, with uh, the resolve uh, for a better future, uh, the vision of uh, President Biden, the aspirations of India, uh, the strength that uh, President Biden has and the possibilities that India represents. Uh, we have an opportunity to take this forward and therefore I uh, would like to congratulate my friend, uh, Secretary Raimondo. She visited India. She took out a lot of time for India. And what she herself experienced there and uh, what she brought is taking forward here. And uh, I can never thank President Biden enough. And I thank you all very much. Well, thank you very much. Thank you for coming in, folks. Press, press to leave now. Thank you.